Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? HTG Brian here, live with a new LEGO game. That's right, we've got LEGO Brick Tales. Big shout out to the devs for hooking us up with a copy. Uh, I just want to basically give you kind of an overview of what this game is. We're going to jump in and take on the tutorial and talk about our plans for this game. And then, uh, you know, probably cruise through the menus and things like that. Uh, answer any questions you guys may have that I will do my best to answer because this is still a new game to me. Uh, but overall, very different, very cool. I checked out the tutorial last night. You can see I actually got a trophy already on the PS4 version. This is available for pretty much every console out there. Pretty excited to play it and share this with you guys. It's so different. It's like, it's like almost like uh, sort of has that visual look and and concept of worlds but also has like splashes of builder's journey and uh, you know one of my biggest pet peeves in the early lego games is displayed in full awesomeness and it works so much better than you ever could have imagined but anyways uh real quick i see there's a lot of people filling in here love to see you guys uh again we're we're not addressing anybody in the chat or anything right now this is a live look i will be answering questions and doing that kind of stuff after we get through some gameplay and whatnot but basically real quick let me just read you kind of an overview the press release for lego brick tales it sees you journeying across five beautiful Lego brick-themed biomes, taking you to the green foliage of the deepest jungles, the scorching sand and sun-drenched deserts, the hustle and bustle of a city corner, the epic sight of a towering medieval castle, and a paradise of tropical Caribbean islands. An intuitive new brick-by-brick -brick building mechanic will help you solve the many fun puzzles you encounter on this adventure and bring your creative solutions to life. So basically... Um, we start off meeting our grandfather and some things happen. Um, and the, the journey is mostly us trying to find a way to get Gramps back. That, that's my understanding. Um, you know, it does say, uh, oh, wait, it says as you search for the inspiration for your grandfather to reinvigorate his rundown amusement park. That's right. So we're not searching for him. We're searching for the elements for the park. That's right. Um, and we got, uh, we got a lot of stuff. So a lot of this has been developed by the team behind the bridge constructor series. So, uh, a lot of those build mechanics and stuff are likely not new or anything like that. So, uh, that's good to know. Um, there are some collectibles and such, and we'll, we'll find out how that's all going to play out. Uh, that all being said, though, let's go ahead and jump into the game. Actually, let's look at the trophy list real quick. So uh, obviously this is out there for multiple platforms, as I mentioned, um, including, you know, PS4, PS5, Xbox Series S and X, uh, Xbox One as well. That's surprising. I mean, not really, I guess, for PS4 as well. Uh, Nintendo Switch 2. So uh, good stuff. Definitely good stuff. Lots of availability out there. Uh, the game is retailing right now for $29.99 US. Looks like $29.99 Euros. Um, so roughly $30. And um, yeah, so good, 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 good. All right, so there is 21 total trophies. So basically 20 and a platinum. Um, so a lot of it's pretty simple. Collect the happiness crystal from the jungle world. Collect the happiness crystal from desert, medieval, city world, Caribbean, Find all treasure chests in the jungle world. Find all treasure chests in the desert. Find all chests. So as it sits right now, you guys, um, I was lucky enough to get a couple of codes from the devs. Uh, they, they've they been put to good use. I got one going here, and I've actually uh, applied another one to our guide writer, Tyler P. Um, he is not going to be able to get to it until Saturday, but both Saturday and Sunday, I am going to guess that he'll probably knock out the whole game and get the guide written. Um, the difficulty of the collectibles and trophies and such is going to be rather low. Uh, the guide may not be really needed, uh, but we're going to take that approach for it and, uh, and we're just going to roll with it. So that's right. We've got ourselves a new Lego game and we'll have a new Lego guide with some new Lego video. So I'll be doubling down doing, continuing to do the free roam of Lego Star Wars while also doing some videos for this. And if we find that it's just super, super, super de duper easy um, and we don't need videos, then I might return or finish the series with some live streams. Uh, lots of people coming in. What's up, uh, Jay? What's up, Tony? What's up, Nicola? What's up, Mike? What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Um, all right. 
I didn't want to ignore the people that have just arrived. I'm sure there's some others out there, too. Looks like numbers are going up. Uh, our Twitter button isn't here, but I'm going to go ahead and hit the Twitter button now. So hopefully I got that good. Um, all right, so this is how the game starts. You get a letter. A rare treasure. What does it say? You've got mail. My grandchild, I hope this letter finds you well. I have made a groundbreaking discovery that I'd like to show to you. Also, a help I hand it to can't hurt. So basically, he's uh, sugarcoating. <laughs> I need to put you to work. Get your butt over here. So when we get to the theme park, which we literally start at, walk down the laboratory elevator. All right. What's up, Grovar? Welcome. Welcome, welcome. All right, so here we are. So uh, I'm going to take a quick cruise around the park just to kind of show you. Um, so, so the basement goes right there. That's how we start. Um, the game is fairly simple mechanic wise. Like I don't walk in, right? I actually have to interact with it. Um, we don't get to see a whole lot. There is a broken down fountain over here. And I'm guessing that each one of these areas is relevant to a biome. We got a Ferris wheel over here. Um, you know, so I, I'm feeling like as we progress, we will uh, enter biomes that get the pieces that actually make the happiness return. Uh, gosh, the camera is not super good here. I, and I got a little, little bit of dimension vibes here too, right? We got that portal up top. That's relevant here in a minute. And what's going on here? Am I cooking something? Am I hurt? I got lots of questions. And you know what the good news is? We can actually go to our wardrobe... And I can customize for days, you guys. Um, you know, I don't. I don't know. You guys know I'm not super big on, uh, you know, character creators and such. Uh, but is there a certain theme I should go for? Should I? Should I go silly? Should I go cool? Should I go try to replicate myself? I mean, if I was gonna replicate myself, I'd have to go with like. I mean, that's as short as it gets. I don't know if that represents. Brian hair. Um, as far as face goes, definitely not a pirate. Uh, definitely not Harry Potter. <laughs> that's a, that's a, that face reminds me of HP for some reason. Uh, okay, we've got some cut ourselves shaving. I don't, ooh. Okay, not gonna not gonna ask too many questions. Okay, so I am sort of a glasses wearing guy, but I don't know if I'm a Harry Potter glasses kind of guy. I guess I am. Oh, treat yourself. Treat yourself. Whoops! Uh, I mean, I meant to do that. <laughs> so apparently there was a, a trophy for a customizing part of... I don't know why. I guess I didn't actually hit the button to keep the brown hair. That's my bad. Otherwise, I would have got that a minute ago. Uh, I do like the black and yellow, right? Sort of representation of HTG. Ooh, 010011. So we got some binary. I don't speak binary. Ooh, what's this? That's kind of cool. Um, and last, so we got head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees and toes. That's pretty funny. Um, ah, that's, that's a lot of, a lot of dark. My mama taught me to always try to contrast colors. Oh, it's after Labor Day. I we shouldn't wear white. Fire, what happened? What happened? What'd I do? I was watching one of your Lego Marvel superheroes. I thought you were like, nice. Hey, welcome to the stream, John. Glad you could stop by today. Um, as far as options go, um, I don't think there's anything that's relevant to us. I, I, I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that the developers were kind enough to us content creators that they did not give us music that was copyrighted. Are you guys ready to jump in and actually check out? Now, now that I'm styling... Ready to rock? I mean, that's me, right? Kind of me. I got I got my Lego How I'm Feeling Today shirt going. I, I wish they had that. All right, so here we are in the basement. There's Gramps. What up, Gramps? Bob Ross is our grandfather? What? Uh, who's next? I love how they slightly tilt the comment balloons, too. Like, at first, I thought it was just me, like, leaning. But you'll see that it's just a little accent that I don't know why. I, I find that cool because everything's so symmetrical and locked in and you know perpendicular i'm using some big words uh who's there is that you my child oh wonderful i didn't expect you so soon 
I want to show you this incredible earth shaking. <sighs> Whoops, D didn't mean to do that. Didn't mind to do that. Did his shirt change? I swear he wasn't wearing Argyle with a collar before, but maybe he was. Well, that was entirely too literal. Are you all right? Um, you see, I was in the middle of wiring up my invention, and what you just witnessed is what we in the business call a rapid unplanned disassembly. <clears throat> In layman's terms, too much power make big boom. <laughs> uh, so not only am I trapped up here, but it took the whole power grid down with it. We'll need to restart the main generator eventually. But first, could you start the emergency generator? So we're going to jump in and actually check out some of the new mechanics that are largely required in this game. Uh, so there's the generator sitting there. And, and I got to be honest, I haven't made it very far. Like, like there's like 15, 20 minutes worth of gameplay that I have played in. Um, I might be willing to check out part of the jungle um, as we will be going through and doing the jungle on a separate thing if we do the collectibles and everything. But so, again, walk up to it. It's not like there's a pile of bricks and you just press and hold the build. You actually hit a button and watch this. It worked. No, there's there's a cool building mechanic coming up real real soon here. We gotta throw this lever. So again, hit it. Woo! Turn on the lights. Zappa generator. Oh, look at that. That's kind of familiar. Hmm. It's rusty. I didn't even think about it. Is that Rusty Griswold? Is that young Rusty? Is this a spoiler of what happens to him when he grows up? Oh, wow, I'm back. The electromagnetic interferences must have pulled me back into this dimension. So portal up top like Lego dimensions. We're talking about dimensions. Hmm. Oh, hello. I am. How can I help you? <laughs> uh, no, I'm not a genie. and You do not get three wishes. Your grandfather maybe years and years ago. He always called me Rusty. But while I was out there in space, I made new friends and was given the alien name. I don't know how to say that. Is, isn't there like a, a famous person's kid that was named? Was it Elon Musk? that did? I think it was Elon Musk named his kid like Zebzorb or something like that. But it was like characters and weird. Like, I can't remember. Uh, you lack the required frequency synthesization modules to properly pronounce it. The closest approximation would be the Blurtle Fleeb. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, but you can call me Rusty. Rusty, I thought I was lost somewhere years ago. Oh, yes, I did get lost a bit after you shot me into space, remember? <laughs> but I saw some wonderful things, and now I'm back. B12 from straight, yeah. Right? I mean, very familiar in that sense, right? Uh, but excellent work, my child. The lights are back on. Based on your problem-solving skills, we could be related. <laughs> <laughs> right you are. We are related. Smart as a whip. Oh, Grandpa's trapped? Yes, let's help him. Let's go. All right, so now we got to find our way up here. We actually get to use the new building mechanic, which is crazy. Looks like we need to get up that platform. Let's hover up. Oh, wait. You can't. <laughs> That's a conundrum. Ah, hold on. There's a perfect chance... To show you what I can do. Let me teach you the power of building. And we'll start by constructing some stairs for you. Alright, so here we get a little learn. You can get learned how to manipulate bricks. Let's go ahead and check it out. So, this is the new builder. Very unexpected, huh? Uh, so here, you guys have seen this before. But like I was saying, this is lovely. Like, the way it functions, it, it's responsive. I mean, there are some situations a little bit towards the end of the tutorial that do feel a little bit like, which way do I go? How do I do this? But after a little bit of toying around with it, I felt like I was doing pretty good with it. So, um, again, only have about 20 to 30 minutes of playtime. Um, but, yeah, so... Uh, here we got a stack of bricks. 
obviously you can see where they need to go for the record too you can spin them around um you can also snap them up and down so oh, oh, I, I don't know why it's, basically it just puts it all the way down so you can see where it is so boom not right there we go pick it up put it on pick it up and put it on all right, so this one does not require a simulation. We'll see some simulations here in a second where a little robot comes out and tests your build to see if it works or not. Oh, well, Rusty, you know how to construct things. How? I don't remember you being capable of that when I made you. All right, so now we got stairs. <laughs> the movement in this game is very different, too. Like, I feel like it's Lego movie. Like, right? Like, I feel like uh, everything is awesome. My name is Emmett, and I'm part of the team. I guessed 2.21 gigawatts was too many. Looks like the generator blew some fuses. Replace them. You can assemble replacement fuses if there aren't enough. So that's a little bit of a clue. We're going to be building ourselves a fuse. Learn how to rotate bricks. Let's get learned. So we're going to pick it up and press square to rotate it. Move it with the highlighted area and press. Good. Select the brick. Hold L1 and square. Select the brick. L1. Oh, that was interesting. I didn't... I, uh, the modifier. How does the modifier work, though? I guess I don't understand what the modifier really does because I I can it doesn't explain the modifier either. Hey Thunderful, it'd be wonderful if you could explain the modifier. Maybe it does down the road. It doesn't in the tutorial. Um, uh, but uh, okay, so this one, so this one messed me up last night. It took me a, a while. You actually need to start with a blue one. I, I put the two. These guys, whatever you want to call them, uh, on there first. So the camera lets you, I mean, like you guys, like it's, it's fairly smart and intuitive. Um, like I said, there are some situations later that I find maybe a little bit troublesome. Um, but, but again, after playing with it for a few minutes, it seems very, 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 very kind and forgiving so um all right so okay learn learn how to control the camera yep yep so okay l1 okay okay so the l1 the modifier is my camera so i missed that tutorial last night i guess uh so let's see here let's go up Lock it into place. Camera around. See, look at that. And if I needed to, I could move the camera again with the modifier. All right. So it does explain the modifier. I was just bad at tutorial. <laughs> nerf, nerf, nerf. All right. So we're good to go on that. Next up, we've got, what do we got? Learn how to use the brick palette. Okay. I lock palettes. Okay, uh, to remove bricks, use Soikle. Okay, okay. See that? When you have many bricks, we place them in a pallet. All right, so it's, it organizes. That's lovely. Uh, with everything nice and tidy, we can concentrate on building. Try to build a little tower. Okay, okay. So we'll go ahead and slap you on there. So, first impressions. Very different Lego game. What do you think? It's, um... It's, like I said, it's kind of like a combo. And, and I think that with... Contracts being a little different, I, and I don't know this, but without the exclusivity with TT Games and things, I think we're going to see more games like this. More companies like Thunderful and, and even 2K and others are going to have the ability to build in this Lego realm. And I do feel like it's going to be pretty 
beneficial to us. And we'll get to pick and choose, right? Like not all of them are going to be your cup of tea, but a lot of them are going to be worth checking out. So, uh, as I said, it's absolutely across the world, dimensions and planet coaster bridge constructor. Cause that's actually the people who are behind a lot of this, uh, mechanics. So here we go. We got a pallet. We got some pieces here. Let's go ahead and rotate this guy. Slap you there. The music is like super soothing too. Like I, I always say that like there's games out there, other like simulators per se, that I feel like could use some ambient music sort of like this. All right, so we look good there, right? Generator all generating, fuses in place. Repair the pipes to get the hydraulics. I don't know why I use like a Don Knotts voice for grandpa. Golly. Uh, learn about brick validity and simulation. Uh, when building more complex things, there are some rules to follow. Bricks that are pre-placed and can't be modified like these two by fours serve as anchors. Rule one, bricks have to be connected to an anchor. Otherwise, they are not valid. See the two by two and two by four? They are not connected to the plates on the bottom. Hence, they are invalid. Okay, so you want me to fix that. I like that you can slide it right into there, too. Now both bricks are valid. Woot! Uh, the two by two brick over there, it's peeking out of the allowed area. It's taking a peek. Prepare to res. Prepare to res. <laughs> Little HTG Apex humor for you. Chacha says he prefers the old school. That's okay. No, no one. Like I said, everyone's gonna get a choice. Some people are gonna. I, I, so far, I've really enjoyed this different take on it. Uh, for me, somebody who's you know usually playing the Lego games in a guide form, it can be kind of stressful. Uh, luckily, I've got the writers, you know, Tyler and others that have helped out over the years and. Um, so you press simulate to see Okay, so this is funny. Watch. It, it's not sturdy. This is going to fall. Bye. And it might earn you a trophy slash achievement if you were playing. I actually got one for building a failed build last night. So uh, that's how I know that. Um, all right. So we can do better. So go press circle to go back to building. Okay. Place the bricks to support the white plank. Remember, bricks can't just float in the air. They are invalid and vanish. So we'll go ahead and slap this guy. We'll just do a replica build. And I mean, technically, I'm I, I could be going a little faster than I'm showing, uh, but I don't want I don't want it to end. Um, <laughs> that's not hell. But I also want to just kind of show you guys. I don't want to speed through it. Uh, no need to heal in this one. And 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 so far there has been no uh, bad aim or whatever. Boy, my mic boom's got a little case of the wobblies. Might have had a extra cup of coffee or something. All right, so I do believe this is the one that I failed and got the trophy on last night. Um, it seems simple enough. You got four 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 by twos, right? Actually, no, this isn't the one. Now that I think about it, this is not the one. I I, I, I remember now. Um, come on. Can I not slide it under there? I thought I could slip it under. See, like some of these. Oh, nope. Yeah, it won't let me sneak it under there. So I wonder if we'll see if it's simu let's see if the simulation works. <laughs> All right, so let's put that back in there. That was funny. Um, can I just place it? Nope. Won't let me do it. All right, so how do we want to do this then? Here, I got another idea. Let's go. Hmm. 
Make a sturdier road, eh? Hey! Get back up there. So, I mean, for those who actually like building Lego, I feel like this is going to be a, a fun, different uh, experience. And, you know, um, nobody's asked about the price yet, but I will say that... Hey! Oh no, is that gonna... There we go. Um, I, I, it might be a bit much. I don't know how much game there really is yet though, so it's hard to say. Uh, I think your start was right, and even the smaller ones on both sides. So I'm good, we're good. I don't know if you have to use all the bricks or how that works. Vertically. Select the brick. Uh, okay. Oh. Oh. Uh -huh. That's convenient, you guys. You guys. Um, all right, so. Place it up top. Now I'll place it on the bottom. Oops. Select the brick, hold L1. Okay. Place it in the middle with X? What? Oh, I wasn't even. <laughs> Duh. Nailed it. Oh, somebody did, huh? I missed it. Reconnect the pipes. All right. So, so this one, I didn't take that other tutorial. And that would exp oh. <laughs> that would explain why it was a little bit tougher for me. That's in. Okay. We good. Nope. Nope, that's outside, huh? Yeah. Red, yeah. I, didn't, I, I don't even see it. Must have been a long time ago. I didn't see it. My bad. And really, I was, I was sort of... Not saying no one's asked me the price. I, I mean, that's probably what I said. But what I meant was, like, how do I feel about the price point? Is what I was kind of thinking. Because, you know, like, brick uh, brawls. There's been some recently that may have been a little bit, you know. You know. What's up, Gaming World? Welcome to the stream. Learn how to manipulate bricks. Learn how to build. Okay. Wait, we already did this, right? Okay, so what the crap? I thought it was a new one. Great, let's get out of here. Okay, I'm good with that. I'm good with that. What's up, Kirsty? Um, up switch. All right, so this is the one that I failed on because there is another bridge build we got to do here. We could build something close to the gap. Uh, oh, yeah, we got to go down over there. <laughs> We're getting fairly close to the end of the tutorial, actually. Build a walkway to reach Grandpa's platform. Um, okay, so what I did was I went boom and boom. And then I went. Uh, 
Whoops. Get over there. Hmm. No, this is not how I did it. This is not. Let's let's run the simulation and see what happens, though. Come on. <laughs> Nailed it. First try. I meant to do that. I meant to do that. I mean, honestly, uh, that's kind of funny. Sorry. Rusty, oh no, where have you been? Oh no, where are your arms? The ravages of time and space have destroyed you. Don't be so dramatic, Grandpa. I've been upgraded. <laughs> you sent me out to explore space, but then I got trapped in a hyperdimensional fold. I was scared at first. But I met some really friendly aliens who repaired me and let me travel the multiverse with them helping people. They swapped out the multifunctional arms you gave me for a zero-point gravity particle generator. Ah, uh, of course, the old three-point god practical generator. Simple technology for an inventor such as myself. <coughs> anyway, it's great to have the two of you here. Now come, let's show you my... Let me show you my new invention. Or let me show you my invention. I'll get it right one of these days. All right. So we're back up top. Where's your invention, bro? Talk? Okay. You see, I was experimenting and made the groundbreaking discovery of how to create portals. It's taken me years, but I think we get we got it to run now. It's isn't it incredible? An incredible mess. Just look at this place. What the park? Oh yes. Um it may be in a state of mild discombobulation. Discombobulation? Oh no. Oh, no? The mayor, she's been telling me for ages if I don't get the park cleaned up, she'll close down this eyesore of a place and have the land seized. I got so distracted by the portal, I totally forgot. There's no way I can clean all this in time. The extent of disrepair is truly pervasive. Have you considered splicing local space-time with the space Spatio-temporal alternate reality drive? I say what now? It's simple. When quantum strings vibrate in phase with disturbances in the microwave background radiation. Whoa, slow down. I don't, uh, my grandchild here <clears throat> doesn't understand what you're saying. I'm so sorry. My apologies. Let me start over. It fixes things that are broken. Oh. Perfect. That's exactly what we need. I'd like to buy three. Do you accept credit card? <laughs> Won't be necessary. I possess the knowledge and equipment required to assemble it for free from parts I have found lying around your property. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? Excellent. Now we only need sufficient energy to operate the machine. Must be the happy crystals? Like electricity? Something more powerful like happiness crystals! They're the greatest source of energy I've encountered in my travel. So did they steal that from uh, Monsters, Inc.? It's like the, the scream cans, right? The stream, scream canisters? Happy what? Please explain. These crystals generate in local space-time wells. When the main karmic positive delta exceeds the value of... Rusty, we've been over this. I don't know those words. Uh, I mean, my grandchild can't understand a thing you're saying. <laughs> what up, Ben? I will simplify. Step one, we help people to make them happy. Step two, happiness crystals appear. Hmm. Step three, we fix the theme park. Step four, everybody is happy, and we go out for ice cream. 
My readings tell there are several locations where people will need help soon. The first one is at coordinates 3904. I don't know what the measurements you use. Is that far away? Considerably so. If we had a... A portal? What? Yes, indeed, a portal would do the trick. See, I knew it would be useful. I will hack into your portal and set everything up. Next destination, lots of numbers. Appears to be some kind of jungle. So you'll go off, collect some happiness crystal, and we can clean up this mess? Precisely. Well then, off you go. All right, so that concludes the tutorial portion of this video. Um, anybody have any questions or anything? Uh, you know, if you look here, so the jungle is the first place that our portal will take us to. And you can see there's 0% of the story. There are 13 chests, 10 shops, and 20 animals. Now let's go back to the uh, the trophy list here. Uh, farewell from the jungle. So we got happiness crystals. So all treasure chests. So that's one in each. All chameleons, ladybugs, rabbits, bluebirds, hermit crabs. Now, so here's my question. I, I guess one of the things that I don't know is... Will we be finding chameleons, ladybugs, rabbits, bluebirds, hermit crabs scattered throughout? Or are the chameleons perhaps part of, I mean, the jungle world? The desert world would then be ladybugs. The medieval world would then be rabbits. Bluebirds could potentially be the city world. Finishing off with the Caribbean being the hermit crabs. They may be themed. They may be themed. Um, so uh, that's one thing I don't know. Now, hidden trophy. I have not looked at these. Shopaholic. Buy all items from the ghosts' shops. Okay, so we're going to need to buy all those. I can make my own fun. Use your first brick from the sandbox. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. And then rapid plan disassembly. Smash all destroyables. Uh, hmm. So nobody's got that yet. I've already got treat jokes out for change the look of the wardrobe at least once and produce at least one simulation fail after the tutorial. Funny enough, I did it during the tutorial. I mean, I guess the tutorial is probably considered the learn and then there's the objective that's actually the other one. So... Uh, let's see here. Thought he did Monday. I believe I did on Monday. Power wash. Did it go out on Monday? Uh, oh, it did. I don't think we did because we got Apex and some retweets and stuff. Yeah. So I, I, I forgot. It happens from time to time. Uh, when my Twitter button ain't here, it happens. I'm not pointing any fingers. <laughs> um so what's the thought? Should I should I dip my toes into the jungle here and see what that's about or should I keep you guys uh salivating and waiting for some videos? Now, um my goal is Tyler's going to start working on this on Saturday. I likely won't have a ton of information from him until like late Saturday, even maybe Sunday. Um I do feel like it's likely going to be a short game. What up, Gray? Uh, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, as you can see, there are 20 animals. I mean, I'm kind of curious to see if there's like bluebirds, hermit crabs, and all those in one. You know, maybe there's, so there's what, five different types of animals. So maybe there's four in each. Or if there's literally 20 bluebirds in the city and 20 hermit crabs in the Caribbean and how that works. But um, what do you guys think? Should I dip into the jungle or should I save it? I mean, we're only at 40 minutes on the stream. I'm, I'm happy to go longer, but not too deep into the level. Because I do plan on putting out uh, 
but we'll use a different save file and all that. I'll be using the PS5. I wonder if the PS5 will look any different. It looks clean for the PS4 version. It looks really nice. The lighting engine, like look at Grandpa, like around his neck even, like his Bob Ross fro is kind of rotating a little bit. You can see the shadow kind of moving. It's almost a little jittery, but... Well, I'm not getting any comments about going into the jungle, so maybe we'll just wrap it up. Jungle? Do it! Do it! Alright, we'll check out this is a smidge of the jungle. Ooh, follow the yellow brick road. Ah, lush greenery, fresh air, and mysterious ruins. There's a ladybug right there. Right there. See it? Right in front of me. Let's explore. And there, okay, so there are definitely different types scattered throughout. Ah! George, George, George of the jungle. Watch out for that tree. A small plane crash landed somewhere in the mountains right before us. I could see parachutes opening. I hope everyone's okay. We have to go help those people right away. Okay, so we gotta build, gotta build a set of stairs. Um, okay. You guys hear that? <laughs> I wonder if this is going to be good enough. So wait a minute. We're going to have to actually go back. Dude, the soundtrack is killer. That's not going to work, huh? That's too tall. That's too tall. Okay, so we're going to have to beef up. Hmm. So this could be tricky, huh? No. I can't get it to go. Oh, maybe it's because I'm not using the modifier. There we go. Yeah. Whoops. Camera flip around. That guy's just hovering. I don't want him to hover. That's not working. Uh, okay, let's go. That's not going to work either. <laughs> okay, so I got to start going backwards, I think. Like, like build it back further, huh? So put one of these guys to make it flush. No, that's not flush. 
Okay. So then let's come back here and start this. The minimum width of a path is two knobs. Giggity. Okay, so those should be same size. Mainstream. Hey, Brian, just joined now. How's the game so far? I'm enjoying it. It's very different. Uh, but I am enjoying it. So I think I'm on to something here. This will be something I'll have to, like, figure out speed up in the videos too because like some of these builds are going to take some trial and error I'm assuming I can walk up the double stack, right? This is just... What happened? Oh, so those don't count? Really? So now... <laughs> None of that works. Okay. Can I build a ramp for that one? All right, so let's go. I'm sure I'm making this way harder than it needs to be. I swear I tried this the first time and something didn't go my way, but so that's not anchored though. So <laughs> nailed it first try. So, in regards to that ladybug, like, I don't have an ability to, like, I don't have, like, any way to grapple up there to get that chest. I don't have a way to, no buttons, do any kind of damage to that stuff. What's this? I can come down over there. Okay, so there is something up there, too. Let's go up there and check that out. Build a canopy. Oh, boy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this might be uh this might be where I want to wrap it <laughs> after that last build. Okay, so it says I gotta build a bridge. Um let's start with these bricks here and just try to keep it simple and see what happens. Um, 
Hey, hey, what up? Eh? Yeah, that's not going to be enough. I'm sure of it. So everybody's builds are going to look different, too, which is kind of fun. Oops, I didn't build the lower. So you definitely find techniques that work for you, right? Oh, I already got those. Okay. Oh, I only have one of those. Okay. So, I'm thinking. Just for structure strength. Put these guys. A little mismatch in here. Don't mind the mismatch. Actually, let's put... I don't know if they'll be able to get up that way, though. Okay, I do have two... Okay, okay, okay. I'm good, I'm good. I'm securing this thing pretty good, top and bottom, and we're all going to get a good laugh when it fails here in a minute. <laughs> I'm probably, again, either totally building this poorly or it's actually overkill. One of the two. Oops. <laughs> gotta, look, gotta have a handrail for the little robot. Uh, nah, yep, that's, oh, I didn't even mess with those. <laughs> no way that worked. I mean, I have built Lego before, but that's a solid bridge. Do you want to be more creative? Check this. I don't know that I do. No. Why would I want to do that? I got a bridge that works. Can I go swimming? No. What you got for me? Travel north? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's a rubber ducky. So there's a bird. That's definitely not a blue bird. Can I go anywhere down this way? Aye. Okay, so I gots to go north. Looks like a switch or something right there, right? Like just hanging out there. There's a record player down there. Scriggity, scriggity, scratch. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I enjoyed that little riff. Help me! I'm trapped up here! Assistance I need! Wait, that statue over there appears to date back to the pa Pala a long time ago. I need to add this to my research notes. What was I saying? 
Uh, ah, yes, that was it. Help, I'm trapped. No need to worry, we're... We'll have you down quicker than two charging cycles of an electric sheep. Okay, so there's another animal. So, does it appear as though I'm going to have to play through story and then come back and replay? <laughs> uh, I had to take care of that. So this is kind of cool. You get to see the map too, right? Like, so that'll be fun for when I'm like collectible hunting. Like, okay, we'll go to the north. And does it say rescue the area? Uh, continue return to grandpa wardrobe options controls. Well, let's actually look at controls and see what what I got here. Interact menu and move around. Okay, simple. Because, like, I don't have... I, I need some sort of snippers, right? Ooh, inspect. The statue is held in place by the vines. I could break them if that was strong enough. I hear that. And that's definitely, like, a... Is that a squirrel or a snail? Hermit crab. And there's a gecko. Can I... I wonder if I can... Collect. Okay, so you don't have to get them right away. Wait! Seems that platform is too unstable! We should put something under it to support it. Alright, I can build a... a crappy support here. I'm curious to see if Tyler's gonna like this. Hey, what's up there, Wally? Uh, early access is this game out. It's actually out today. Uh, I have had it for a while, but uh, today was the first day I have uh, played it. So I wonder if I can do something like this. And then perhaps... Hmm. Good for your home? Okay, so... And it needs to connect to both of those pieces. This is not at all where I thought it was. Come on. What? It's it's actually kind of hard to see. Okay, so No. Oh my goodness. Okay. Now let's actually get rid of this guy and put this guy. Ooh. 
Wow, that's so weird how that does that. I'm sure it's something I'm doing, but... <laughs> it's a funny angle. Yeah, I will definitely be editing. <laughs> Oh my god. Huh. So close. So up top. No, that's close though. <laughs> See, you tap right and it moves it way over here. That's crazy. And I tap up and it just doesn't go where it should go. I just want it to go one spot over. Oh no. Can I undo? That should be a thing too. Oh yeah. There we go. So I think I have to turn the modifier on and off. Oh, oh. <gasps> Nailed it. First try. It's kind of touchy. So I was like really big on this coming into this, but I don't know how I feel now. It looks like it's uh, on it, but it's not. You know, it's definitely a me thing. Not that that was ever in question, but it's just a matter of like perception and how you come into these. I mean, is it pretty? No. Does it work? We'll find out.
So I'm fine if you come from the ends. It kind of helps. It's so weird. It, like it looks like it's in that spot, but it's not. What do you think, guys? Is this gonna work? Is this okay, so it 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 doesn't work. <laughs> okay. So nothing may break, it says. Oh my goodness, you guys. I don't even know. I'm trying to uh, get this a secondary point of attachment. Oops. Nailed it, first try. This place is amazing. Thanks for helping me out. I'm a local our oh easy for me to say, archaeologist exploring the area. Oh boy. I was actually starting to believe in the curse of the mountain spirit. Ha ha. My sensors detect no other life forms nearby. Were you alone? No, there are two others, the pilot and a journalist. I wouldn't worry about the pilot. I think she could take care of herself. The journalist, though, pretty sure his panicked jittering shook the plane out of the sky. We'll find them as fast as we can. Do you know where the plane went? The pilot was screaming something about landing on top of the mountain. You should check up there. Oh, and you should take this whip. 
Brigade Archaeologist has one. Well, all the indies at least. Whips are a nightmare for corporate legal departments. Whip it good. Now I can use it to grapple. Thank you. I'm sure this will come. Use. I hope it does. And when you find the others, tell them to meet me at the base camp site. Aight. Use. Whoop. Nothing down now. So you can't just like willy nilly whip whenever you want. You have to use it at a whipping point. Hmm, we've never been here, but this entrance looks oddly familiar. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Others oh, near the mountaintop. Wait, this signal. I recognize it. This is alien technology. While I was lost in space, I met them and they helped me upgrade myself. That's how I got so smart. I bet if you take me over there, I can learn something new from that podium. Interact. Kim is out there saying he cannot access the chat. He's asking me if I knew that the chat was disabled. And I was like, but it isn't, though. People are chatting. It's live and happening. So what up, Kim? Good to see you. Good to see you. Even though I am not seeing you on the stream yet. <laughs> oh, wow. I feel I feel so strong. Like if something was held down. Oh, I pushed the button too soon. Do you know anything like that? I really want to test out the strength. Um, all right, try to smash the crowd. Sorry, I was just trying to help Kim figure things out. Ooh. Okay, so I got a ground pound now. But slam! Oh, is this how I do it? All right! Smash to smithereens. Okay, so now I can go back and collect at least the ladybug, right? So I can only do ones that have the tops. Right, 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 okay. So I wonder if I can do, there's there's tops down there. So smash, see? I can go around the back side. Giggity. But slam for the win. Okay, so that ladder takes me. So, oh, okay. So do I have to get this chest? I don't want to get it. That's what's next, though, huh? All right, let's see what happens. Bananas? You got 50 bananas! All right! I don't know what the bananas do, but... I have a feeling somehow I'll use them to uh, lure some baddies or something. Monster, you made it! Good to see you. Good to see you. So technically, I didn't need to grab the bananas. Note to self for guide video. I'm going to try to keep it like story based. And Oh, okay. Well. Press to smash into the ground. Okay, so I got to go the other way. Dag nabbit. There's the ladder that drops me down on the other side all the way over there. Whap, 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 whap. Uh, what's happening? 
It's one of Brian's triggers. Oh, yeah, Legos. Yeah, I've I seen it. I saw you commenting. And I, I, I did see it. I just chose to ignore. I pretended it wasn't happening. So technically, the story will be all about building and um, getting all the items that you need, then returning back to play it and uh, free play, basically. Right, because I didn't need to grab that chest, but I have one of 13 now. 9% done with the story. So there's a lot to be done here. And then that's a... Okay, so there's a hermit. I guess I can see what's good here. Oh, we smashed the statue free. I feel so much better now. Let's see what happens when we spin the wheel. Yeah, already ahead of you. Already ahead of you. So there's a bluebird, too. So, I mean... So far, they're like, right. Oh, what's this dude doing? Passionate biology. Okay, let's figure this out. Copy the monkey statue? Jeez. Is it supposed to look at it or how? Okay. So we got feet. And then it looks like this in the back, huh? Which way does it go? It goes so that... Inside. Okay. 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 I think that's right. Then it looks like this guy in the front. <laughs> and then probably... This guy. Followed by this guy. Um. Okay, so clearly it's not right. Ah, uh, I seize it. I seize it. Oops. <laughs> Damn. Teflo, what up? Okay. So whip it good. Let's talk to Buddy here. Hmm, my senses tell me this tree is not a plant. Shh, be quiet. You scare off all the animals. What are you doing here? I'm here to study fancy animals, especially those fascinating chameleons. They are so well camouflaged, I can't find any. Maybe you can bring me some? I think 20 will suffice. Okay, I've got bananas. I don't think I'll be able to bring you 20 chameleons, though. Uh, so there's a chameleon, but I don't know if I want to mess with him, though. I wonder if it'll give me 20, because, like, I got the bananas. That's just bananas. Look for the others near the mountaintop. <laughs> so I should be able to butt slam and make it a little further over this way now. Yeah, see, I can go this way. I don't think rubber duckies are one of the things, are they?
So there's another chest. There's another hermit crab up there. So somehow I find a way up there. Another hermy. Another chest. Can't break that stuff. Please find the others. Our plane is crashed. Okay, so. another chest and should I just open it open them all and see what happens more bananas great <laughs> so I'll go open this other chest over here too I'm curious when you collect that one chameleon. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, chameleon. I got banana. I got banana. What's going on over here? It's a nice view. So, what's this? That's a glitch, huh? And I can't get down there. Bananas! I am rich with bananas! So, ladybug. So what's next? I mean, I, I, there's a chameleon back here. I guess we can test it out. Because there's nothing else I can do. Does it just give me one or what? 19 more to go. Oh, boy. So, yep. And is that 19 more? And is this the same person? How are you in two different places? We gotta spin this every time, huh? What about down here? I guess I didn't. It's just a Hermie. What a beautiful animal. Could be important in the future. Just cute. So it looks like they're gonna be relevant to. Let's see. I am playing on PS5. Raised is correct. Let's go see what's inside. Let's go ahead and grab this guy over here, too, now that I'm grabbing everything. Oh, wait a minute. I thought there was one over there. This is weird, huh? There's a chest over there, but how do we go though? There's a chameleon up there too.
Pizza. Pizza sounds delicious. So there's got to be like a jump or a go-go gadget arm or something that we're going to get soon. Another bluebird up there. How the crap do you get that? Can you pull this lever? Ooh. Ah. Nice. He's got moves like Jagger. Bananas? Hey, I can see the future. Boy, we're loaded with bananas. So I wonder what these things are. And these things. That's got to be something. Those are tips. Improvise a stairway onto the hill with some planks on hand. Okay. Okay. Hey. Actually, no. Got to go, uh, okay, okay, okay. I didn't realize there was the backside, too. Giggity. Ah, uh, that's perfect. So let's go. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted either. This is going to work or not, but they're anchored. Here, let's go square. And then... See here, it's got to add a pile of earwax snake. What? Clean the earwax. Oh. So is that telling me it's bad? Okay, so that won't even work. So all that won't even work. Okay. I 
think he can just go right up in the... Actually, let's go here. Okay, so, so far, so good. So far, so good. I like it. I like it. Probably do something like that. And then... Actually, no. Let's go. Oops. So that's not going to work, actually. So let's go take this guy. And let's go here. And let's put one of these guys right over here. And then let's go a couple of these guys just because we want to spread out the build. Okay, and how's he doing? Okay. Um, hmm. Probably put one of these guys right here just as a balancer. So this one <laughs> and then how many I got one more okay so now nah, let's take that back Still got a long ways to go here, don't I? Oops. Nailed it. Look at that beautiful bridge. It's so beautiful. 
us a good builder at Beautiful Bridges. Ground bone. What's inside here? Probably be wrapping it up here in the next few. I'm Boo, business ghost extraordinaire. Please have a look at my wares. So I have found one of... Over here in the new colors and bricks in the sandbox mode. Okay, so I have... Wait a minute. It says, okay, so there's 10 things in the shop, it looks like. And I probably got to buy them with bananas. 12 bananas. 20 bananas. 22. Okay. 18. 18. So 18 and 22 is 40. 60, 78, 80, 90 bananas. So we need 90 bananas for that stuff. 15, so there's 30, 30. So, okay, so 30 and 30. And 100. So 160 and 90. So I need 250 bananas. 250 bananas. That's a lot of bananas. <laughs> Help. Help. First it was the blade. Now I'm stuck in a tree. I just want to go home. I don't need this kind of stress in my life. What's going on down here? All right. Whip it good. Da -na 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 -na. You must whip it. Oh, whip it good. So wait, what's this? Inspect. With all the airplane parts lying around, we could easily make some sort of flying machine. We need a propeller and a place to sit. Okay, well, there's a propeller. And a place to sit. 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 Oh, it's up there. We have all the parts we need. Quickly, let's build something and save him. That saxophone's kicking in. It sounds delightful. Okay, so place the seat. Is that really the first item? No. No. Yes. No. Gonna have the best flyer around. Y'all see. Y'all will see. Um, okay, so. Oh, I got to put it on a post. Okay. Hostess with the mostest. I see. Hey. Bonnie Angle. Where's the propeller go? <laughs>
I think it's going to be a little back heavy. What do you guys think? Hey. Right. Here, let's do... Uh... Oh, I can't place that one there. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, boy! Love it. Love it. This is the new Brick Tales game, that is correct. Whatever gave it away, was it the title? <laughs> Don't be a meanie, Brian. Don't be a meanie. I see the ladybug! Okay, I know I'm supposed to say buddy, but I'm doing other things. I'm busy. Wonder why there's so many of these just like to slam. Ground pound! <laughs> well, you, I mean, you, you kind of. <laughs> uh, I feel like uh, I, I didn't expose anybody. I feel like if anything, you exposed yourself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nothing but love. Nothing but love. Build the gyrocopter. No, I'm good on the gyrocopter. What's this? Oh, no. No. <laughs> I like to move it, move it. I just want to talk to Buddy. I don't, I don't think it's build, is it? Build a gyrocopter. I've got it, though. How do I interact with dude? Oh. There we go. Hey, what up, Evan? This is going to be on PS4. In fact, I'm actually playing... See if I can show you here the PS4 version of it right now. PS4 Lego Brick Tales. You can see here I've also got the PS5 version too. Lots of double whammies, right? Got the got the PS4 and PS5 there. Only PS5 here. I, I just downloaded this this morning. Anybody played this? I'm curious to see how the opinions are on that. Fearful reporter. Thanks for getting me down, but you've got to find the pilot. Please, I'm so afraid. I miss my couch and my kitten. Her name's Mittens. I shouldn't have left her side. Unless that flying contraption of yours can get me home, that's that pilot's my only way out of here. Please find her. I see the plane, but no sign of the pilot. Do you know where she could be? What up, Alex? She refused to abandon ship. Said I'll fly this thing into the ground if I have to. So maybe check underground? Wherever she is, I'm certain she's alive and well. Probably signing autographs, too. Okay, well, I'm tired, afraid, and I'm going to be going back to camp now. Farewell. Bye. Follow the journalist south. Is this a bunny? Let's go ahead and collect a little bunny. So I'm actively like I was avoiding everything, but but I'm like trying to pick up everything now to kind of give Tyler an idea of, you know, what I learned. Uh, why the jungle? I hate the jungle. Never should have come here. I was supposed to be a short interview at a restaurant. Oh, it's you again. What a coincidence. I was just on my way back to camp when I found this gap. Short story shorter, I'm stuck. And I'm scared of this play of place. In case you were wondering, terrified, please help me. One crossable gap coming right up. All right, so we need to build a branch. I need to build another branch. 
Um, okay. That's one thing that's cool about this. Everybody's going to build something different. Um, you know what I mean? Like, that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. Let's get this. It sort of reminds me of, like, some Fat Boys type stuff. <laughs> So I wonder, too, if the game will allow me to sort of cheat. Like, if I build this up to a height that supports the rest of the build, but I put some of these flat, non-studded tops on, is that going to allow... Because, I mean, basically, pressure, right? Gravity is going to apply to it, even though it's not stuck to it. Ah. So I'm wondering if each biome, too, has its own music, or if this is the sounds. I mean, I, I very much like the the monkey kind of beatbox remix. Ooh, that's a fiver. Psych, it's a sixer. Okay. I'm really just kind of building as I go here. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a stair down. Okay, 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 okay. I got this. I got this. Yeah, I'm getting gooder at this, y'all. I'm getting gooder. So I'm going to try to save those flat pieces for, like, the actual stairs. Come on. No. On the angle. I don't want the modifier on, but I guess... Bring it. Okay. Hmm. Not exactly how I envisioned it, but... go and I got one more four I'm probably gonna regret using it here but whoops hey hey I like the undo that's a nice feature okay so let's go I wonder if this will work Man. Oops, I wanted a four there. Uh, that's a five, isn't it? No, it's only a four. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, that's right. I got to connect those. Okay. Uh... I don't think this is going to work. Okay. 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 It does. It does. Actually, I don't need the biggies.
Or do I? Oh, okay. That's... This is such a makeshift bridge, it's crazy. So let's go symmetrical, huh? I mean, as best we can, anyways. Actually. Actually, I don't need to do that. I just need to uh, build this up now. Actually, let's go this guy. And this guy. And then... I guess this guy, huh? Throw one of these guys onto the side for good me measure. And then we just need another lower piece. Let's go ahead and cap this off. And let's see if it works. Oh, it's two though. Oh, it worked. So he can get up two. That was surprisingly stable. Right. Say my first bell, boy. Oh! Oh, shoot. How am I supposed to get down this cliff? Bluebird! Bluebird! So I've got six of the 20 and five of the 13, and, and I need... I need 20 chameleons... To get back. Okay, so can I? More cliffs and canyons. Why not a staircase? I can see the base camp, but how will I get down there? Do you possess the ability to fly, such as myself? Um, no. Your body is composed of injection molded plastic, and you can easily survive a fall from the side. <laughs> I don't want to walk off a cliff. I can guarantee you are quite bouncy. Still, no. Then perhaps we can construct a chairlift for this zip line. Uh, build a ride for the zip line. Okay. Don't get me wrong, I like building. But come on now. We only have gosh, limited. Okay, so Hmm. 
It's weird they give us the different colored bricks too, huh? Got to clear that antennae. I'm one spot off. I want to be like. Ah. Hmm. It's not what I'm after, but. All right, so let's try putting this guy on, keeping it simple. <laughs> That's not going to do it. I don't know if that's going to be good enough because of the fact that it's. Still not connected, huh? <laughs> okay, so let's try to put a row on the bottom. That's not what I was going for, but there we go. Oh, this is tricky. It's a funny angle, y'all. So I wonder if I got to take this guy off. What? No. There we go. There we go. Okay, so I need some forward balance. Okay. Watch this. I need another
Still a little too... Hmm. If I could only... Still seems too top heavy. What? How am I gonna? I oh, mean, maybe I'm doing this wrong. <laughs> Nailed it! Yup, 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 yup. How long am I going to be trapped inside this mountain? Mountain spirit? So it's probably the pilot, huh? I stumbled from the skies when I woke. I was sealed in this rock prison. How terrible. Of course it's me. I left from this cave. Okay. You survive. Hang in there. Hang in there, really? I can <laughs> Oh, boy. Aha, this artifact that I found earlier seems to fit right in here. Here we go. Join the archaeologist in the cave. Hey, guys. I'm going to go ahead and cut it right there. Uh, my goal was to check out for a bit. Oh, Tyler's here. Do you got to build lots? Yes. It's definitely a big mechanic of the game um some of the builds are probably pretty easy some of them are probably gonna take some time some trial and error um you know just as an overview again i'm 81 percent done with the story on this area this biome uh from this area right now of overview you can see there's another chameleon down there we've got another hermit crab up there both of which seem to be unreachable at this time but that would give me a total of nine of the 20. now there's likely going to be some inside there i see another chest Ooh, you know what i think i can get another chest right now let's go ahead and check it out see if i can get some bananas we know that i need 250 bananas there's 10 more 250 bananas in order to clear out the shop and buy all 10 items in the shop see there's something going on here i don't know how exactly to get up to that hermy i'll peek in this cave real quick too and see what else i can see see what the pause looks like from in there um uh. I need to get past this door. It seems to be some kind of a... So there's definitely going to be like a story-based element with how to get through some recommendations on the builds. And that'll definitely be better for editing, right? Like me creating these builds sometimes can take 20, 30, 40 minutes because I'm bad. Uh, as I get better, it'll come easier. And I'm hoping there's not going to be as many crazy builds. Like I'm hoping that the difficulty has reached its peak. And then it'll just be a matter of like, you know, figuring it out and getting gooder. Uh, but yes, definitely builds would be a good way to show the solution, right? You could show kind of the steps of how I got there, what mine looks like. Um, again, there's definitely a bunch of collectibles scattered throughout. Uh, there are trophies slash achievements, depending on which uh, platform you're playing on. Now, if you're on the Switch, there is nothing there. But um, as you can see, I got a couple of the easy ones. One for failing a build, one for doing a quick outfit change. And uh, there's lots more. So uh, as mentioned, we do have plans to put some guide videos out. Those will be trickling out. I don't have a particular schedule yet. I will likely get the first one out Sunday, Monday-ish. Um, there will continue to be Lego Star Wars videos as well as live stream. So as you can imagine, my schedule just got a little bit busier than it was. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this stream today. I hope you guys will enjoy this game. Um, 
Again, at $40, it might chase a few of you away being a different game and not having many kits and sort of being traditional. But, you know, if you're into uh, Lego builds, this is definitely a fun game. It's a very new twist, a digital builder, if you will. So, uh, but yes, I can't thank you guys enough for hanging out today. Much love to you all. Big shout out to my hookup that helped me out with this. Jeff, a fellow Oregonian who actually works for uh, a company called Plan of Attack. So, uh, much love to you guys and, of course, uh, everybody else that helped make this possible. And, of course, all of you out there watching, hanging, all the mods, all that stuffs. Ooh, Dragon Girl showed up a little late. It's all right. We were short stream today. You're not late. I'm early. <laughs> but, hey, much love. Hope to see you guys, uh, well, on Friday. There is a possibility of a bonus stream today, but I'll post and let you know if it happens um and yeah that's about all i got people so hey head on over to any of our social medias if you have not already please check out happy again i can't thank you guys enough much love enjoy the rest of your day see you soon as always until next time see ya.